after that, going back to that third down play, it's raining. They've just scored. The stadium's shaking for Boston College. What's going to be your mind? Uh, just that uh, before we went out there on the field, I knew that uh, we had to battle back. We had to respond. And uh, I told the whole team, just, just keep fighting. The game's not over yet. There's still 10 minutes on the on the clock, so there's a lot of game left. And, you know, it comes down to that third down, and you know, I knew that we had to execute a play. And uh, you know, the whole line, they gave me great time, protection back there. And, you know, I had, got time to get the ball off. And, you know, it's just something that we've been working on. There wasn't a whole lot of pressure. You know, just got to stay relaxed and just have some fun with it. And you know, I knew that it was just going to be a little battle, so, you know, there's no need to stress about it. So. We at least played, and you know, we were relaxed, and we drove down the field as good. Mike said that they've been playing some press man previous to that. Did you have an idea that that's where you were going to go on that play if you saw that's what they were going to stay in? Oh, yeah. Uh, that's something that we kind of worked on throughout the week, and uh, we've, we've worked on uh, that kind of coverage all, all year, and uh, you know, I knew that we were prepared for it. I knew exactly what he was going to do on the snap of the ball, so that's kind of the whole chemistry that we've built, and you know, we were prepared for that situation. Coach Morris mentioned in the last couple of weeks, someone important from the offense goes down early on. So as an offense, what's that like when you have to change things up, whether it be a quarterback, running back, whoever? Uh, yeah, it's kind of a mentality thing. You know, it's kind of, you know, Coach Sweeney has been emphasizing like next man up and you know, one guy goes down, next man steps up. And you know, that's great with our kind of team that we have because the coach does such a great job of preparing everyone to the best of their ability and being able to have one guy go down and the next guy step up and not have a drop off. It's very important to us because you know you never know when your opportunity is going to come. And to be able to have such great depth uh, at our, on our team is very helpful and very useful. The, the two passes where your receivers had to break them off, what happened on those two plays? Uh, it was just, um, I don't know, I was just a little bit behind on the throw, and then just kind of, a, I don't know, just kind of getting it out. I don't know, I think it's just a little bit off on me. Is it a reads thing, progressions, or is it simply just waiting for the play to develop? Uh, both. <laughs> uh, yeah, it's kind of a read, pre-snap read, or knowing the coverage and uh, watching the play develop as you're playing. Cole, not that you weren't comfortable last week when you talked to us. Is that level, has that level increased sitting here today? Your comfort getting ready for this week as opposed to last week? Both, you know, pain tolerance and... Oh yeah, it's a lot more comfortable. You know, there's um, a lot less pain. Uh, you know, I'm, it's still a little sore, but nothing serious. Uh, you know, I'll probably go this game without a shot, probably. And, uh, you know, it's, it's good going in this week and just having another game plan, another game to get prepared for. And, yeah, it's another exciting, another exciting week to go out there and get ready. Austin College driving down the score. I noticed Coach Morris came, sat down, took a seat right beside him. Can you share a little bit about y'all's conversation? On that last drive? Yeah, right. When BC was going down the drive to take the lead, he came out and sat down. Uh, it was just, uh, we were just sitting there talking there what we were going to do going in for the next drive and be prepared for the next thing. Yeah, that's what we do after every single drive. We come down, we sit together, and we just talk of what we're going to do on the next drive, what we can do. And, what we can correct that we've done, that we've seen. Uh, you know, that's just strategizing for the next thing. Coach Moore said after the game, the philosophy on that drive was you guys were going to air it out a little bit, maybe take it down the field. Is that part of the conversation here? Yeah, you know, we were talking about like this is probably what they're going to run on the coverage right here, and these are some of the plays that we're thinking. And uh, you know, if you see this and that, it's what you got to go to. And, you know, that's something that I, I really like sitting down and talking with Coach out on the field. It makes me a little more comfortable. And, Relax that everyone's on the same page. Cole, uh, obviously you guys want to score and put up as many points as you can. How comforting is it knowing you've got a, a, a defense like that out there just showing out like they, they've been this year? Uh, it's, it's extremely comfortable knowing that uh, if we have a three and out or something like that, or if we're uh, a little bit behind, that we have a defense, uh, top defense, a very strong defense that can. Uh, get the ball back for us. Yeah, it's very comfortable because I knew after we scored that touchdown to go up on the lead, I knew our defense was going to stop them, even if it got all the way down to one because they've done it before. And we had full faith in them. And, you know, I, I really wasn't nervous at all when uh, Boston College was going down for the win because I knew our defense was going to make a stop. Uh, 
not even a little bit? Okay, they're, they're like one percent, <laughs> but like uh, <laughs> I was, I was fully confident. And I know the whole team was too, because as you know, so we've seen how our defense prepared, practice and play, and uh, you know, we had, we had full faith in that. How's that?